We didn't talk about this ever, but I really suggest a yoga mat or something that has some cushion underneath you, especially if you're on a hard floor. Even just this little thickness can make a world of difference in terms of the padding. Okay. Uh, but if you're on carpet or some other kind of rubber flooring and it feels comfortable, that's fine. Now what we're going to do is the quadruped position. So we're not down here. We're not up here. We're nice and flat in the middle. And what we're going to do is with the pelvic brace, we're taking a deep breath in. Exhale, activate one, one, and down. So you're bringing those arms up. And ideally, your body isn't rotating all around. So if you could look at me from this view, deep breath in, exhale, activate, one, one. Okay, so your spine and your pelvis is not moving side to side. You're not moving up and down. You're staying stable. Let's do it 10 times on each side. Deep breath in, exhale, activate, one, one. Relax. Deep breath in. Exhale, activate. Pull that pelvic floor in. Two, two, and relax. Breathe in. Exhale, activate. Three, three, relax. Deep breath in. Exhale, activate. Four, four, relax. Breathe in, exhale, activate, five, five, relax. Deep breath in, exhale, activate, six, six, relax. Deep breath in, exhale, activate, seven, seven, relax. Deep breath in, exhale, activate, eight, Eight, relax. Deep breath in, exhale, activate. Nine, nine, relax. Deep breath in, exhale, activate. Ten, ten, and relax. Okay, super. Now we're gonna add on to the child's pose. So last time we were here, now we're gonna rotate to one side, okay? And so I'm rotating and kind of crawling my hands to my left, and I'm getting a significant stretch here on my whole right flank, all the way up to my arm. So breathing, relaxing, just letting your body sink into that stretch. Let it feel good. And you're gonna stretch in different areas based on where you're tight. Stretch, sink, relax. Okay, good. Now we're going to go to the other side. And whoo, nice stretch. I'm going to, I'm just going to do it from this angle too, so you can see it a little differently. Yes, stretch that arm, stretch that shoulder blade, stretch that whole left side of your body all the way to your pelvis. And of course, we're letting our pelvic floor be nice and relaxed, our abdominals are relaxed, all those openings are soft. Okay, Tomorrow, we're going to add on to that. So good job and keep at it. Remember, there's not going to be one exercise that's like your perfect exercise. There's going to be multiple exercises that you're going to feel good. And there's going to be some that you're going to be like, oh, I didn't really feel too much with that. So, uh, and then there's going to be some that are painful or maybe too hard. So finding the balance between what works for you and you want to be challenged but not too hard that you're not able to do it with good form and good quality okay be sure to share and i'll see you tomorrow thank you bye bye